Jesus. Why are you in here taking a, and why you got makeup on? Oh, sir, are you okay? <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, the Oreo X. Okay, so we back with another freaking Sim Self video. I don't even know, like, y'all. I decided I don't want to do a Sim Self where I'm living in the city, it's city living, or get famous. I don't even know what I was trying to do, but I, I didn't like it. So I decided let's just go ahead and just go for it. Let's just do the university. I wanted to do this from the jump, but it took it, it took a couple takes to record the other video, and it was just it was a struggle. So I was like, you know what, scratch it. We're not doing it. Let's get into the Sims. Let's do this. So I have my Sim Self here. As y'all do know, or I don't know if y'all do know, but I am in college um, in real life. I go to an HBCU, so I only thought it was right to put myself in an HBCU that I actually would love to go to in real life. But, you know, college is very expensive, so I'm just going to what I can afford. I'm going to a very small HBCU called Paul Quinn College. It's in Dallas, Texas. I'm just giving away everything about me, huh? But um, it's really easy to look up, honestly. Like, I had a whole YouTube channel, and I vlogged on it. And I'm not going to tell y'all about it. Y'all just got to find it yourself. But, um, yeah. Yeah. So here's my sim self. I am wearing a what is this Clark University Clark Atlanta University hoodie school is actually today y'all like on the on the thing school is in two hours class is in two hours. Um, I actually had this already ready to go. We're just gonna start off from right here because you know whatever who cares. But first I wanted to give y'all a little bit of a campus tour real quick. Everything that you will see will be linked below because I all got like pretty much everything from Sierra the Simmer. If y'all don't know who she is, she's pretty much the like creator of all of these Clark Atlanta um, builds and CC that you are going to see on this um, video. So be sure to go pay for her Patreon and download it or I don't know if she has some for free. Just make sure that you go support her and download it. Go subscribe to her channel because I absolutely love her. Um, love watching her videos. I'm going to try to do my own own like my own little college video LP I don't know what I'm about to do but we finna make this work we're gonna have to make it work because I really want to make it work so let me give y'all a little bit of a tour it's pretty much the same thing that she has I just kind of changed a couple of things around so right here in the front pretty much you have everything the same sorry that the cars look like this because I got reshade on but you got everybody's car you got the U-Haul moving truck and this had to be set as a residential lot simply because it just doesn't work as a campus um, housing I don't know why but it's fine uh, we in this neighborhood over here y'all and then there is a student center over there we'll get to that in just a moment but pretty much outdoor is the same when you go in the double doors here we have um I changed this around these used to be just some chairs I decided to put a couch there because I just felt like it was more like campusy homey I don't know maybe I don't know but I thought this is cute limited campus tours available which means y'all finna get one from me right now um then you have the front desk where all the people will come in and check in the key boxes it's so accurate because this is like it's very similar to my campus um like my in real life college campus sort of when you go through we have a couple of people already out here as y'all can see over there but this is basically where you would come and register for your dorm because or your classes i don't know but this is really cute i love the way she decorated this like it's just so freaking cute she marked her territory with the delta sigma theta out here um i love that love them all support you got a couple of vending machines right here then you have their little Little kitchen slash dining cafeteria area for us we have like a little kitchen in our dorms in real life it's not this fancy but we got a stove a fridge and no we don't got no fridge we got a stove a microwave and a sink and we can cook whatever we want but this is really nice I think this is cute I think we have to hire somebody I don't know if I already hired somebody already but I think we have to hire somebody to come and cook for us for there yeah and then over here that is Layla I think this is Layla Rice I love her she's so cute but we have we have a couple other people living in the dorms with us we have these two I don't know why they in a pajamas girl put on some clothes we is y'all is in the video hold on girl put on your outfit and you got school sir who is this Dion put on clothes what is you doing why is y'all out here naked child so anyways this is like the main floor room this is basically where i know it says 2019 right there but don't don't mind it um this is basically the hangout area for my school we would call it like the purple lounge area because our walls are purple and it's a lounge area it looks kind of similar to this it just has couches a tv and yeah um and here they got a what is this a playstation a xbox i'm tripping i can't talk they got an xbox to play right here they can watch some tv 
um, music to listen to and they can play some ping pong they can come and study in here over here in these chairs areas not really I don't think they can really reach that chair over here in the corner but in real life you will be able to reach the, the chair they got some pizza boxes who was ordering pizza somebody ordered Domino's child but um yeah this is Tootie right here why is she looking like that she mad because I changed her clothes and then this is Dion they are so cute maybe they might date I don't know but yeah this is the first floor lounge I'm gonna go downstairs first as soon as I figure out how to get there child how the hell do we get there oh it's right here so right here we have Tay Tay stinks why do you stink Tay Tay is gonna be one of our lesbians of the dorm she's pretty gay um Tay what's wrong is you sad because you stink huh she stinks y'all that's probably why why she looking like that but whatever this is the laundry area downstairs in the basement this is where they can come and do laundry but i don't have laundry day so y'all gonna have to bear with me i don't have no laundry day so they not actually gonna be doing laundry um they're just gonna have to stink uh then they have some vending machines down here they can get some food from some little study areas to sit and wait on their clothes to finish or just to study i just love the detail she put into this like look she like it just looks so real and I just love it. Um, this is so dope. And then over here they have a computer room where they can come. I don't know where the computers are. Wait a minute, since this update, this update is really irritating me because it took away the doors, it took away the computers. Like where is everything at? But there are some computers right here. I'm gonna put them back. Um, but basically the computer room where they can come and study down here. They can get a snack or whatever in here. And it's just such a good time. And I just love how real this look so let's go back upstairs okay so back in this room back to the main floor we're just gonna go upstairs excuse me miss layla excuse me we're gonna go upstairs to the second floor so this is a co-ed dorm which means that boys and girls live here um obviously it's like hella people that are able to live here but because this is not a university lot it's just a house only 10 people can live here which suck or nine i think or i don't know how many but I didn't make it to like one floor as dudes. I made it to like boys on one side and girls on one side on each floor. This is Mia. I don't know why she looking like this. I need to fix my reshade or something. Why is it doing all of this? But that's Mia. This is, I don't know who this is. I think this is Mekai. But on the second floor, you have this little chill lobby area right here. Super cute. Where they can come and study and print some stuff out. Watch TV, hang, or just give views of outdoors so that's pretty cool and then here are some dorm rooms this is one room right here it's not really up to date well it's not really decorated at all i don't know who's gonna sleep in here but it's not super decorated at all much um then this is like this is their this is their bathroom i was like what do you want to call this? this is their community bathroom this sucks this is i don't know who this is i forgot his name but this is one of my sims that i created majority of these sims i can't see his face majority of sims i download from the um the um gallery but a lot of these i did create myself like this one i think i downloaded from the gallery i don't believe i actually created him but yeah over here is another dorm room pretty much all these dorm rooms look the same on this floor i did not decorate anything but they are there for you to decorate so if you are watching this video and you go and download this lot it is there for you to decorate so going up to the third floor y'all i'm trying to go through the stairs but i suck at this so the third floor is the same way right here the lounge is there you got a third floor lounge to decorate not decorate but study chill with your friends whatever and over here is also another bathroom super cute okay so when you come right here this is i think one of the ra's room right here this is a kappa ra room one of them is a kappa i forgot which one it is one of them one of the ra's is a kappa uh, his room is not all the way decorated because this is all that i wanted to do at the time um i had to move the, the beds down because it's not functional with the dressers under them um, but I put a mirror in here, I put a couch right here, and then there's his bed, I made it red, and yeah, it's not all the way done, eventually I'm gonna get into it, um, but I'm really only gonna be controlling myself, so bear with me, across the way is another same little dorm room, down this way, um, I pretty much left everything the same, I did kind of switch a couple of things around from her build, so just bear with me, um, right here, we have, I think this is gonna be my room, this is Ariel's room, so this is literally my style i love pink i love i don't know i might change the color though but i do love pink i think this is just so cute so i just kept this 
same style just move the bed down and i kind of moved a couple things around simply because she wasn't able to get to her bed with like the boots in the way or not the boots the backpack was on the floor and it was in the way the couch needed to be moved up a little bit but this is pretty much how my room would look like and it's almost similar to how my room looked like in real like in real college with my roommate we loved pink my best friend y'all we coordinated with pink so much because we love pink but i think this is just so cute and i still wanted to do more because it just looks a little blank at the top and on the sides of the walls but it's all good and yeah across the way is just somebody is gonna be a delta living in here but um uh, not decorated at all except for that right here um we have a couple of people this is almost kind of my style right here because i love like ariana grande sweeter and then you got maroon five and you got troy you got all the people okay so i love this it's gonna be somebody who's really into into music right here i don't know who's sleeping here but somebody into music and then across the way is gonna be somebody a part of alpha kappa alpha or aka whichever you want to say um pretty in pink somebody who is a part of aka okay somebody really pretty and i put this picture up here because i thought it was just so cute and yeah then right here you have tootie's room and then her roommate i don't know who her roommate is but it's still decorated the same exactly how um sierra did except for like i changed a couple of things around simply because you know the sims weren't able to get to their beds or do whatever they needed to do without um things being moved so i moved a couple of things around look like they're their computers are gone y'all this update is stressing me like thanks for fixing the mirror wall thing on the update but everything else is just is stressing me out but anyways tootie is going to be ak not ak she's going to be delta sigma theta as you can tell by the flag on her wall right here and she's just really into red and everything like that so that's why a lot of her clothing is like red also because she goes to clark atlanta university so yeah this is pretty much the tour of this dorm room i think they have a kitchen somewhere y'all i just gotta find it they got like an actual kitchen i just don't know where and this is supposed to be the kitchen area but no they had like an actual kitchen kitchen like am i tripping dog am i tripping but yeah this is basically their dormitory now let's move on to the rest of the campus okay you guys so i brought my little sim cell over here and this is basically one of the main student centers look how cute i am oh my gosh i love my sim okay what is this white lady doing on this campus no offense let me stop maybe she's a teacher let me stop being rude y'all i'm not against white people okay please don't come for me i'm just saying this is a hbcu anyways <laughs> anyways let's go this is the um student center one of these student centers i have two i don't know if they're both by the same people i think one of them is by alexis ariel but this one right here i believe is by um sierra the simmer so make sure like i said check out her patreon everything will be linked below but this is the student center you have a couple of students out here just walking and hanging around look she decided what she want to get at the vending machine right here miss girl with her little black pride black what is this her little kente cloth uh hair cloth whatever thing okay so when you come in here this is basically the uh, cafeteria area obviously some things are not supposed to be like this because i don't have the cc or i don't have the um pack that that is supposed to that, that it requires but here you just have some people going to get some food at the cafeteria look at this girl like this is a deco sim by the way so don't mind why it looks like that i don't know if this is a deco sim is this a decor yeah this is a deco sim um look how like good the textures are on the doritos and the the food like oh my gosh whoever texturized all this stuff y'all are so good but this is the cafeteria you just got some students out here vibing and eating some lunch and studying or whatever so this is really cute then once you go out the door across the way you have the school spirit store i'm pretty sure that's not the door to go in this is the door right here but you got somebody coming in to buy some stuff you got some people going out who have bought some stuff um this is not functional y'all you cannot buy anything in here all of this is decoy or decorations whatever you want to call it um but you got him on the job smoking how you smoking on the job sir we on campus you're not allowed to smoke but this is just the school spirit store and then you got her running like 
she must be coming from soccer practice or something already like school just started child but yeah coming back down here you have a coffee shop i don't think you can see it because i can't go down much more but you have just like a little starbucks on campus but you got a little starbucks on campus hey okay so let's go to the second floor um right here on the second floor we have I could have went to the stairs right here, but on the second floor, you have basically the student area where students will go to class and learn some things. Some of this stuff is really messed up, y'all. Like, this this update is messing up my game. Like, what is this red mark on the floor? But this is supposed to be on the table. I don't know why it's not, but you got some lovely black queens sitting down having lunch or supposed to be having lunch. You got her on her phone over here. What is you doing, girl? Texting your boo? But um, basically, this is where some students have classes at. This is a classroom right here. You can see the teacher is clearly teaching some math or something. Across the way is like the library study computer area. So this is where students can come and get them some books back here, whether it's for class or whether they just trying to read and come and look for some books and come over here and sit down and chill with their friends. They can get them some food from the vending machines and yeah then over here is another classroom it looks pretty lame nobody's over here they just study it's not really a classroom but they just there and then there is a bathroom right here for them to come and use the toilet if they need to pee okay okay outdoors they have a basketball court right here if they ever want to just come and play some basketball this is always available for them um they have a couple of food concession stands right here they got dunkin donuts and whatever this is i don't know exactly it's a piece of a little thing uh, you got some girls over here skating y'all skating on campus i mean go crazy and then a ping pong table and this is where i'm trying to get downstairs hold on let me get down there for y'all so i can't get down there while it's daytime but it's fine um down here is the starbucks coffee shop slash outdoor area right here so you could come outside and eat dinner or lunch or whatever with your friends out here outside of the Starbucks coffee shop. Um, it's just so cute. They have a freaking Starbucks on campus. We don't got no food on campus at my school. And then here are the stairs to lead back upstairs. And yeah, so that is pretty much it for this student center. Let's move on to the second student center. Um, it's not the exact same creator. I don't think Sierra the Sim simmer created this next one but let's just go ahead and see it so this is the other student center i'm not gonna go through it too much um but it's super really it's really it's really pretty it's very modern has hella glass everywhere but it's super nice you have a concession stand out here you got cinnabon they got cinnabon on campus okay but they have a couple of concession stands right here they got a starbucks concession and then right here is the front door actually i think this one was made by sierra the summer and the other one wasn't or maybe both of them are but i don't really know but this is basically their cafeteria over here on this side um yeah and then through these doors nobody's here obviously but through these doors is another chill area for them vending machines they got visitation i don't know what this is actually it's just a desk but then they have like a tv over here some ping pong tables some chairs to sit at black lives matter because yes and then we have of course the bathroom here for them to use the restroom and yeah that's pretty much this down here here's a school spirit store over here um they got a lot of stuff in here this is basically where they can come and buy some school supplies or they can buy some gear for school they got some backpacks some leggings shirts whatever the case may be uh, we might role play coming to buy some stuff obviously we already have something on ariel outside but on the second floor is once again the learning area so a couple of classrooms as you can tell right here lecture lecture hall some computers and whatnot outside um another bathroom and then another look she's already over here getting getting her school work done i think but um look now she stole our gear girl that's what i'm wearing this ain't even me but basically another area for them to come and work some bathrooms upstairs on the third floor it's just a library a library with um some computer areas over here this is very much cubicle vibes and very much corporate american slave okay so um yeah here are some libraries computers bathroom and study rooms in here so if you need to work with your group 
projects or whatever they can come in here and study or whatever and it's real cool it's really cute it's very real like i like this it looks so realistic and then on the fourth floor it's empty there's absolutely nothing up here because i feel like maybe she just left it for if you want to decorate it yourself you can have access to the rooftop so let's say we have a rooftop party or something this is very very nice so that is pretty much the tour of this student center all right, so here we go. This is the Panther Stadium, and this is also by Sierra the Simmer, I believe. But I do remember seeing Alexis Ariel has something similar to this um, on her channel. Uh, so basically, she has, it's like a stadium. So basically, you just come in, and let me just, you know, you come in, and it's basically a stadium out here. It's, so this is the stadium, you guys. You have a couple of people out here. Obviously, they're decoy sims, but you have a whole bunch of, like, greek platform areas or whatever whatever you want to call this you have a whole bunch of people out here for greek hump day hump night whatever so pretty much all of the divine nine yeah hold on i think i got the whole divine nine out here even the iotas okay period so you got everybody out here to sign up for your greek interest or just come and support the greek people i don't know when i want to do it but definitely very soon i want to be able to like have like a little hum day hum night where everybody just comes out here hang out listen to some music talk to each other make friends or whatever have like a little day party and i thought that was just so cute and she just made this really cute i'll put this in the description below as well i just recently got this from her patreon so definitely want to go check that out it's so freaking adorable i know some of y'all are gonna be like girl is this even legal are you allowed to do this um i really hope so because this is cute i actually love greek culture like i don't think i ever really want to be a part but i'm saying like i like greek culture i think it's really fascinating and i respect everybody it looks so fun they got the little slip and slide hey the little slip and slide um she over here look taking a call again you got everybody out here this is so cute the decoy sims are very adorable i put them here by the way y'all because i was like it looks a little bland without nobody here but once more people start to come it's gonna be better it looks a lot better obviously it's because of my reshade like watch when i take off my reshade the decoy sims are gonna look perfectly fine but i prefer reshade because it just makes the game a lot brighter and it's just like it makes it look a lot more smoother and pretty but they over here skating um you got the cotton candy machine you got some games right here she over here handling with the dj booth right here and then he over here smoking and then you got me feeling skeptical about him who is this i don't know who this is but who is this luciano okay well that's luciano he walking by with an umbrella and a louis vuitton face mask on but yeah this is basically the stadium i know it's not really like that big as a real stadium and it's like right here it's smaller than a damn house but yeah that's pretty much that now we're gonna go visit the alpha kappa alpha house and the q house so let's just go over here okay so here we are at a greek grove houses this is basically where greek houses are um we got the kappa house why is he without pants who is this man oh my gosh hold on y'all so this is the kappa house over here on this side as you can tell that's a whole bunch of cc in there broken but um that's the kappa house and then right here we have the aka house and the q house and then right here i'm gonna put another greek house right there but i just don't know which greek but we're just gonna really quickly visit inside both of them so on this side this is the aka so when you walk in i don't know where i got this house from y'all by the way but i got it from somewhere down here it's downstairs you have the garage it's nothing special and then i think this is like supposed to be going to the backyard and then here's their backyard nothing crazy nothing fancy yeah and then going upstairs you have them they have like a little their little emblem their their letters and just a little picture frame of aka on the wall just to let y'all know who it is y'all know who it is and then here i don't know why q is up in here why are you here but you got one of the q sitting on the couch watching tv probably watching twilight but they have a whole bunch of cute pink stuff not too much stuff in here but I thought it was cute to just make everything kind of like pink and green because that's their colors. Here is their um, kitchen. Super clean and neat. Nothing crazy. And then going upstairs again. 
this is where their bedrooms are it's about two bedrooms and a bathroom so here's one bedroom for one of them she got purr on the wall super cute very simple nothing decorated really and then here's another one nothing much decorated at all but it's still really cute and then here's their bathroom very basic who is this why are you in here taking a and why you got makeup on is that something you want to tell us oh sir are you okay y'all why is he in a bathroom taking a okay i got i got wicked whims on so his dingling is out but this is their bathroom mirror gone okay whatever child get whatever so on the cue side um it's the same thing downstairs it looks exactly the same nothing is decorated but when you come up over here they have their don't shoot american flag right here painting whatever i think that's really cute or like just meaningful see why y'all in each other's houses you supposed to be in aka house and he supposed to be in the q house y'all confusing me child but basically here is their their little slob they got a whole bunch of posters on the wall over here they got some weights because they be lifting weights or whatever tv their letters and then they got mcdonald's and wingstop okay a basketball they got a whole bunch of stuff not really a whole bunch of stuff but they got a couple of things up in here not too much uh if y'all watch sierra the simmers videos you can tell like she had a party in here i think i just wanted to make it look you know presentable just in case somebody do want to come over here or something i don't know but then going upstairs into their bedroom area they also have two bedrooms and there is one bed right here ceiling fan and then another one right here is all oh they're talking she all on his bed but he got hella boxes of shoes and all kinds of stuff and then this one over here he got shoes under his bed and then he got guns on the wall okay hats on the wall and he is doing some homework over here why do y'all have flour why okay whatever um then he got a sack of food even though there's no food in there but pickly wiggly i haven't heard of that story in a minute and yeah this is basically their room they over here chilling what y'all talking about they over here chilling kicking it getting to know each other kicking and whatnot that's cute that is pretty much the greek house for alpha kappa alpha and the q's and then same for kappa you can't really see in there because i need to go over there and visit why this man don't got no pants on okay whatever but it's, i don't really want to go visit like y'all just have to look from a distance hold on can i zoom they got pretty much the same things just decorated to fit their specific organization so yeah that's pretty much all and he over here doing push-ups in the middle of the street well on the sidewalk is this what you really want to do right now i guess sir whatever let's head back to the dorms okay so we are back at the dorms school is about to start or class is about to start in 40 minutes it's monday like i said i kind of just started this whole thing like right right when it was supposed to like you know they about to go to school but we're back in the dorms nobody is here who is here who is this oh this is mia she feeling sad let's go and brighten her day real quick because we're just gonna be nice i'm not gonna play too much in this episode i just really want to do a campus tour and then maybe like introduce ourselves to everybody okay did you brighten her day okay i'm brightening her day we're gonna ask to follow her on instagram because we're gonna still try to do the get famous situation but in college, you know what I mean? We're gonna maybe be TikTok famous. What is, what was y'all doing? Hey, I got a new follower on Instagram, period. So now we're, let's just go talk to, well, he's sleep, okay. Who else is around here that we can talk to? Where did he go? He went upstairs. Well, maybe we can wake him up. He, get up, you're not that tired, wake up. Let's wake him up and then we're gonna talk to him. Okay, we woke him up. Now we're gonna just talk to him. Um, Let's just go to class. It costs to go to class, $3? Or somebody eating. Oh, I'm about to go to class, y'all. I mean, technically, school is starting in right now. Class is starting right now, we gotta go to class. We gotta go to class. Go to, can we, do we actually go to class with him? Girl, go to class. Why is you trying to go talk? go to class please if they gotta go to class and we can't go with them then girl you gonna have to hurry up you going a little too slow i'm not going okay this is the school building right okay i'm going to class omg y'all it took too long but she going she going to school she finna go to class she a little bit late because you know 
that's just me but let me speed this up a little bit girl you are late i'm attending class i'm learning how to paint you know the vibe learning new painting skill that means we're gonna start selling we're gonna start selling selling artwork okay i finished class you guys so look i got homework to do pause let's see what homework do we have to do i have to take a final exam already give a presentation submit a term paper oh my gosh okay well we're gonna start our homework let's just do our homework go do your homework you don't have to do it right here oh she finna go talk to somebody who is that oh it's this girl i mean you could meet her halfway you don't have to like make her walk all the way to you ariel come on now don't be rude. Okay, do your homework. Oh, she doing her homework right here outside the classroom? You could really do it at the house, you know. Come on, let's go over here to the student center and... Not a robot. Okay. Since she want to be like that, come to the house. Come to the dorm room. And who is she talking to? Who is that? Who is this? Who is this that she's talking to? Okay, now he got swag. Who is this? Who is this young man? Hold on. Who is this? He got a little bit of swag. Okay, I see you, sir. Let's do this, period. Okay. All right, let's go to the house. She want to take all day. We're just going to come back to the dorms. Stop talking to him and come to the dorms. There she is. Okay, and then we're about to end the LP right here because I, I realized the sound is not on for the sim. But it's cool. So, you guys, that was basically it for this little first episode. I really just wanted to give, like, a campus tour. And I wanted to just show you guys what the campus looks like and showcase all of these beautiful people's work. Um, you can get the Clark Atlanta University override from Alexis Ariel's Patreon. You can get these builds from Sierra the Simmer, like I mentioned. I will put everything in the description box below so that you are able to download it and put it into your game yourself. Um, hopefully I got everything. If I don't, let me know if I'm missing something. But all credit is to them because I didn't create none of this. I don't know how to build. So, yeah. Anyways, I hope that you enjoyed this video and let me know if you want another one really, really soon. This video is probably going to be posted next week while I'm in Georgia. Probably won't be able to make another video on this until I get back from Georgia. I'm pre-recording, so just be aware if it takes a little bit of time for this to upload another part. I am probably currently in Georgia when you're watching this. So I will see y'all when I get back from Georgia. And yeah, I hope you all are having an amazing day and yeah that's pretty much all i have to say so bye